to my youtube channel i hope you're all doing super well and if you are new here hi i'm Brooke, and thank you so much for watching this video so basically i haven't been filming for ages i haven't done a video for ages just because i'm gonna like have a little sit down chat with you guys um just because i haven't felt right to um i have obviously everything that's happening around with the coronavirus which i'm not going to talk about too much in this vlog i hope because literally it's just overtaking the world and i completely get it people just want to kind of reflect on it and watch youtube videos to get their mind away from it so i completely get you um but i just haven't felt right i felt so gross i've literally had a tan last night so i feel like much more refreshed i've had my eyelashes done i've just curled my hair i took this morning out to really pamper and put a bit of makeup on and really just kind of make it feel feel nice this vlog um but today i'm going to do a little, little day in the life might be over today and tomorrow as well because i don't know how long it is because it is like 12 o'clock so i wanted to show you my outfit as well this is my chill at home outfit today so it is this co-ord from in the style it's like a borg set it is so cute i'm um this could be a bit longer like i got this in a massive size and like normally i wouldn't need to top in this size but i just thought it'd be nice if it was longer otherwise it would just cover my boobs so be aware i'll link it down below it's so fluffy and so cute and i'm so excited to wear it but i haven't been able to wear it that tan because i was like no um i'm literally watching someone over my road who i know doesn't live at their house go into the house like just stay home but today i'm gonna do some studying so i've got a list to do on my phone <laughs> I'm going to pop on some fluffy socks as well because my feet are freezing. So yeah, I've got a list to do. Um, I've got photography work. So obviously we still have to do our photography project, even though we're not at college. And ours is abstract, which I don't have a clue how to do it. And we've basically got to take photos that look like an L. I'm just like, what the hell? I'm not going to do that until later because... Just because. Um... And then I'm now going to do some media because I thought I could crack on with some stuff that I haven't done previously. So I've got a list to do. Everyone asks me what the app I use. So if you follow me on Instagram, I update this every day. Um, but the app I use is Microsoft To Do um, Word. Like, it's cool. Like, you can change out the font and everything. Um, so media mind maps for each set text photography l pictures wash my hair which i've done curl my hair which i've done film day in the life edit day in the life your thumbnail and instagram shot i'd like to take like a little instagram outside in the sun today because that i'm gonna go on a walk and all that as well um obviously i'm not seeing dan at this time and it's really hard i didn't realize how hard it was being we haven't spent this time away from each other for like three weeks we've done holidays and stuff like i've been to dubai for two weeks so that kind of set us up for it but and obviously we don't know if it is just going to be three weeks it's really hard um when you're with someone every day and then you're not it's just kind of like weird um he is obviously allowed to come and just wave when he's off to work because he's still working here and there um which is weird but yes it's not great, but I hope you're all staying safe out there. But yes, um, let me get on with some work, set up the work, and we can crack on. So, I have been, like, really focused on sociology um, over the last month, really. Like, media's kind of been on the back of my mind. I don't know why, but it is probably my least favourite A-level that I do, but I still got to do it. So, the person that I really, really use, and I think is fab, if you're doing media A-level, is Mrs. Fisher. She's really good. She does, like all of the basic kind of things and then expands on it and I think it's really good but before I do any note taking or anything I'm going to start on my folder because I've got loads of stuff in here but I want to organise it into what set text they are like I've done in my sociology so a lot of you guys actually asked me to kind of see how I organise my folders and everything and so I'm going to show you so basically I'm going to empty all of this and then I'm going to get stick I get wallets like 
you know what wallets are guys and then i'm going to just do it exactly like that and let's go give me love give me all your love oh cause i want you no one else makes me feel this way don't know what you do them into like theorists and then um adverts and stuff and they've all got like these on them so i can clearly see and yeah i'm just going to basically go through all of them and do mind maps for them and that's going to be like my base thing and i can see how i can do essays on them and stuff i'm going to just build that up and just going to do a revision notes for today um and yeah so let's crack on with a few of that and i'm going to watch mrs fisher for that and i've also got this book that i use occasionally but obviously it's massive and it's nice to have it in front because i feel like it sticks with me a little bit more oh sorry um and then yeah and then after that i'm gonna probably what's the time it's half past 12 so i'll have some lunch in a bit um i had rice krispies this morning which was nice um and then go on a little walk later with probably mum i went on a walk yesterday it was really really nice um that one day walk <laughs> and me and dan said that like uh, one day this weekend we're going to do like a facetime dinner date which would be really really nice as well i might vlog that um and yeah you and me yeah that's all i need and i'll be all right i'll be right here i swear that I've just popped on a jumper because I was a little bit chilly. Um, I've done my Tide thing. There was loads. She's done a really good little thing. Um, definitely recommend her. I will actually link her below because she's really handy. I'm just going to close my laptop down and have some lunch. It is one o'clock now, so it's lunchtime really. And in college, it would be past lunchtime. So I'm taking it as that. I honestly need to stop eating. I'm going to have some mac and cheese, um, which would be nice. This is the book I've actually been not reading at all. I've actually been doing recently so i bought this on amazon it was about eight pound ninety nine nine pound i think which is obviously quite expensive for some but it's a book and i like i don't mind spending money on these kind of things because it's like keeping me active as well and it's basically one of these kind of interactive books where you kind of reflect on yourself and if you don't feel like at the minute, kind of like obviously it's just me and my mum at home and stuff and like obviously i can chat to her about anything but like sometimes you just kind of want to write and sometimes especially for me you kind of just want to chill and reflect on life and the, but especially at this time where stuff is so uncertain i feel like this is the perfect time to kind of look and think what you want in your future and stuff so this is perfect so you can kind of look at like five milestones that have made me who i am and then this is like the future in one week now i will <laughs> Which is going to be a funny one to do because what am I going to be doing in a week today? Um, and things like that, my partner and stuff. And it's just really, really nice. So I definitely think that if you are looking for a book that's going to keep you active and stuff and doing something, this is the book. I'm going to, I'm doing like a two couple of pages a day so I don't do it all at once. Like this one's going to be quite a chatty vlog, not going to lie. Like I feel like I haven't chatted for you guys for so long. It's like right to. I'm sorry about the screaming kids behind me. Honestly, they scream all day every day like they're so sweet and everything but they are screamers um obviously i've got my mac and cheese here now yum the sun is so nice coming on me literally i think that a lot of people would be absolutely miserable during lockdown if the weather was horrible like i know i would i would just be wake up in foul moods i know we can't go out and enjoy it but it's still nice to have um yeah so how is everyone doing with lockdown i feel like a lot of people are trying to be like this positive on socials but behind closed doors they are just like i'm fine throughout the day i get fine and then at night it hits me and i'm like i'm going to bed by myself i'm more like hmm great but like at least i'm with my mom and like we like get on so well and i'm in like a happy family and like do you know what i mean like i absolutely I'm like gutted and so like sim I like have so much sympathy for the people that have abusive homes and things and obviously the NHS are putting their life at hold for us and things and I'm so thankful and obviously last night was the clapping for the NHS which was so lovely my street wasn't really doing it which I was a bit like rude but um yeah I've been surviving on Disney plus what's that noise why is it so noisy on my street um 
I've been surviving on Disney Plus, which I have honestly, I'm going to show you all the movies I've been watching. And luckily, I still have got studying to do. So, yeah, but I'm going to eat my mac and cheese and scroll through some Instagram and enjoy. So, I'm currently outside. That was weird. Um, doing some work because I was like, you know what? I'm not going to sit inside when it's such nice weather outside. So, I'm like, I wasn't even to get anything up. I'm doing water raid now, representation. I'm gonna do this and then I'm gonna do some burn after writing writing. And yeah. The only thing about being outside is that it's a bit windy, so my things keep thing and I live as you can probably hear right near a train track. So that's fab. Um next week I really wanna sort out a bit of my garden, like it's a bit in it so that's something I'm going to work on. It's, I have sat out here for about an three hours so I have done a good bit of sun today. Um, not that I'd catch any at all but now I'm actually going to go for a walk. Um, I'm going to go to the toilet, I'm going to pop on a different top because I don't think this is very appropriate and then that's what I'm going to do. I have been writing in my burnt after book and it's kind of given me a different kind of mind i'm going this is my going to the shop to outfit with my air forces and my fluffy socks i should have changed them they look so chavy kids wash your hands oh shit happy birthday to you happy birthday no and then Let's dry them. It's not very good. Dry, dry, dry. Bet you never thought on my YouTube channel I'd be showing you how to wash your hands. But yes, I'm now going to sit and watch some Disney Plus because if I've got Disney Plus, it is really worth the money. They have got every Disney movie that you can think of. One second. They've got some really, really good Disney movies on there. It's £5.99 a month, or you can have a seven-day free trial, see what you like, see if if you want it, and then you can obviously get it. I'm going to definitely get use out of it. It's got just so many good movies, and I would definitely recommend it, obviously. I know it's like a hard time with money and things, but if you want something to take your mind off this weird, crazy world at the minute, it's a good one. Um, tonight, I don't know what I'm going to watch. I think me and mum might watch Lady and the Tramp, the new version. <laughs> This is what the layout is like, and that's got literally all the movies. You can see all the movies I've been watching, and I'm gonna watch Cheaper by the Dozen, which I love. Guys, I am currently watching Moana, one of the, one of the cutest movies ever. It's got my drink there, just popped on a pizza, and that is everyone. Tonight, we have watched Friday Night Dinner, which was amazing. A proper lift up. Um, to I think going on at the minute um, I've done some Instagram questions and answers and I also done a live and yeah tomorrow I'm going to maybe do a video maybe not do a video we'll see um, I'm going to edit the video tomorrow and hopefully take an Instagram post as well but I just thought I would say thank you so much for watching if you did enjoy give it a big thumbs up at the minute all the love and support like goes a long way at the minute because Trying to get like my channel up there as as long as like so many people are doing videos, um, it's hard to get my name out there. But be safe, stay positive, and I'll see you guys very very soon. Bye.